Hi guys, Daz here with another news bulletin. This time it is episode 30. And you probably noticed I didn't say comic book news bulletin. That's because it's not. But it is a story I have to tell because it's about my all-time favourite character and a character that is loved by millions around the world. We are talking Rocky Balboa. And Rocky Balboa has not starred in his own movie since 2006, yet creator and star Sylvester Stallone has still found ways to bring back the character in the first two Creed movies. Now it seems Stallone is not done with the character just yet, as the Oscar nominee has revealed the work he's done on a proposed prequel TV series to the hit boxing franchise. Now this isn't the first time that Stallone has talked about the prospect of a prequel series for his character, but it's the first we've seen of what could come to fruition. Stallone posted on Instagram the treatment. And it's got me very excited, guys. Very, very excited. And with that, he posted, this may be the strangest posting yet. I started out this morning by writing a treatment for a Rocky prequel for streaming, ideally 10 episodes for a few seasons to really get to the heart of the characters in their younger years. Here is a small portion of how my creative writing process starts. Hope it happens. And then I needed to clear my head, so I went fishing. Talk about extremes. Keep punching, my friends. Imagine a time machine that will simply transport us back to the origins of Rocky, Stallone's treatment begins. A cinematic world brimming with characters that have been beloved by people around the world for nearly five decades. Climbing aboard that time machine that will take us to the most transformative generation in modern history, the 60s. Needless to say, the 60s was a dynamic time. Yet among all this social seismic activity, we drop in on the rather plain life of 17-year-old Robert Rocky Balboa. When we first meet Rocky in 1976, he was a very lost soul, a forgotten man, a wasted life until he was transformed into a winner. Now we see this young man struggling like all young people trying to find their place. Now this isn't the first time that Stallone has spoken about a potential Rocky TV series, revealing in an interview with Variety in 2019 that the idea was shot down by series producer Erwin Winkler, who largely controls the rights to the Rocky. Not Stallone, which is interesting. There was some conflict there. Yes, the actor said he felt in his mind that Rocky was primarily a feature film and he didn't see it as being translated for cable. So there was a big bone of contention. Now it would appear that perhaps the contention has evaporated. And we know that in the age of streaming, there are about 100 different venues that would love to have the young Rocky TV series. Now, I had mixed feelings about this. I am a huge Rocky fan and to me, Stallone portrayal of Rocky should have won him an Oscar uh, I like the character that much I am open to seeing a new actor take on the mantle see a young Adrian, a young Paulie yeah why not um, maybe Stallone could narrate it a little bit bring back that old school vibe um, yeah exciting times for me personally let me know what you think guys that's Daz over and out come on Rocky bye